Time and again on this program, we've given you personal stories on how difficult it is to get a mortgage. Three of our producers have been asking, trying to get a mortgage, and they've been jumping through hoops to get through all the paperwork. Bob Massey joins us now. He's the host of Property Man. Uh, Bob, um, what chance yes, sir. That some of this mess is going to be cleaned up this year? Because our guys are pulling their hair out with these rules and regulations and bank stuff to get a mortgage. Well, you know, there is, there is movement to try to sort of deregulate again, and it's controversial because, first of all, the question is going to be, can the Democrats and Republicans come to any understanding to reform the Consumer Finance Protection Organization, which basically was there, Stuart, to oversee the banks and make sure that they were doing the right things. But local community banks are frustrated. They're saying, look, there's too many regulations. We want to loan money to local people, but this is too powerful, too much of an oversight. So the underwriters are still concerned, Stuart. The underwriters are still looking at credit scores, income, tax returns, because they don't want to have bad loans again. So it is diff And it's very, very tough for young people, Stuart. Yes, I mean, very, very can, difficult. Can you back me up on this? because we've got a production mm -hmm. team of, I think it's eight, nine, ten people. Three of them are having trouble. Is this the kind of anecdotal evidence uh, that you've been hearing in your own line of business? A lot, a lot of people are tearing their hair out just trying to get a simple loan. Yeah, and it's the thing that's really the problem is there's a lot of people, for example, that had short sales, and they're still getting hammered by the lenders because it isn't four, five, six years out. So as a result, a lot of people had to lose their home by way of foreclosure or short sales, and they're still being punished for it, even though they now have a good job, they have good income, they still have that stigma. I have, I have clients of mine that are trying to get just lines of credit at the bank for their business, yeah. but because they had a short sale four years ago, they won't touch it. Very difficult right now. A lot of oversight still, a lot of regulations. And it's not going to be cleared up this year, probably. Is that what Bob Mass is saying? I I, th I think we're still looking, and the more I read about, matter of fact, I was just reading before I came on with you, the, Na the National Mortgage News that I read, they're saying, look, there is a lot of controversy among the Democrats and Republicans on what kind of reform should be made in order to loosen up money and also help the local community banks. They want a loan. Credit unions want a loan. Community banks want a loan. I don't know if it's going to loosen up this year, really, Stuart. Uh, Dodd-Frank's got to go. But, okay, Bob, now you've got a new yep. show. It's called Property Man. It premieres on the Fox yes. Business Network. Everybody, all our viewers, yes. watch this for a second. Watch this. I'm going to help real people who are facing some major problems explain the bold plans that are changing how Americans live and take you behind the gates of properties you have to see to believe. At the end of the show, I'll give you critical tips you need to know in the messy memo because information is power and the property man has got you covered. What's that drone doing there? I saw some <laughs> drone on a property. It looks like a Nevada. <laughs> Yeah, it wasn't delivering food, I could tell you that much. We did a uh, third, uh, third season of the show we did last year in Scottsdale, Tucson, and Phoenix. Did some great stuff. That drone is how realtors now are selling yeah. homes. Mm. They've got the drones. Of course, there's a lot of regulations. You've got to be careful of privacy issues. But it's the new thing. And, of course, it's only going to grow when it comes to selling real estate. But I'm very honored to be on the network. And you're always so kind to have me on. Uh, it's going to air this Friday at 8.30 Eastern. I think this is the best season of all we've done, yeah. Vegas, Florida, and as you know, we should get better as we keep going, and I think this is the best of all. For your benefit, Bob, and our viewers, I shall repeat that. Fridays, 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time, The Property Man, Bob Massey is the guy. Bob, thanks for being with us. We'll see you again soon.